What's up guys, this is Traveling Pinoy, let's get started. So today we are unboxing the Canon Selfie CP1300. It's a portable printer. I actually got this through a private sale for a really good deal. And I ended up actually getting another one in another location. And the uh, only problem with this one here is the damaged box. <laughs> and I got this way less than what I actually got this for. So we are actually going to be focusing on unboxing this piece here. But then, let's fast forward on what you're getting. Okay, the first items that uh, you will get when you do the unboxing is the manual, the warranty. You can go through uh, <laughs> this. For me, I'll do it later or never. Now, the next item that you will get is... Uh, the paper now this is a special paper um, it's a 4 by 6 or 100 by 148 centimeters I'll show you guys how it works later and then the next item in business is for you to place your paper in your put the paper it's actually quite easy I'll show you a demonstration later now the next item that you will be getting is this baby here now there's only six loads here that you can use and uh, the cartridge actually um, sell, is sold separately. So there's not a whole lot here. You can do some testing to find out if your printer actually works or not. Now, the next item that you will get is of course the adapter. Simple as that. It's actually quite, uh, quite big, which is actually not that bad expected and then you got the of course the basic cord here for the attachment and now last but not the least is the printer itself okay now this is actually quite nice <laughs> oh wow so I actually have two versions of this like I mentioned and it's actually quite nice now I do have the black version of it and uh, I'll show you guys what you guys are getting. Okay, so what are the difference between the white version and the black version? Nothing really, but uh, let's darken this baby up so you guys can clearly see. There you go. So it's just a collar and uh, it's actually got a really nice design. So you can actually lift up the, um, the screen here for adjustment. Sadly, this is not a touch screen. Yeah, it kind of sucks. Oh well, but uh, hopefully the next version will be coming out soon. So the Canon Cell PCP 1300 was actually released back in 2017. The price tag is actually not that bad. It's about $150, uh, but now there's actually some sales, so you can actually get it way cheaper than that online. So locally, it's about $150 Canadian dollars. And online, it might be about $100 or less, depending on the website that you go to. Now, let's set this aside and let's focus on some of the features here. Okay, it's time to show you guys the features of the Canon Cell PCP 1300 here. Let's start at the back here. Now, the back actually have a special feature here, as you guys can see. This is where you plug in your, of course, basic plug-in. And then uh, the best part about this is you can actually buy a battery pack for this but the price tag is actually quite expensive apparently it's the same price as the Canon Selfie itself now let's open this baby up and there you go and um, on the side here hopefully you guys can see that okay there's the pin there for the battery now hopefully I may be able to find one for a really good price or pre, who knows, <laughs> maybe someday. But uh, other than that, it's actually quite a really nice design here. And there's even a fan here for the exhaust for the heat. Now, let's put, let's put this back here and I'm going to show you guys the location for the ink cassette here. You open this baby up and there it is. Now, I do have the old cartridge for this and a quick uh, note here, uh, the cartridge that you get from the printer only prints out five since I got this used already um, they actually used up the uh, prints as well so 
it says here postcard four by six inch size five printouts okay and then uh, it's actually a really easy um, installation here it actually gives you the direction where you're gonna place it so and there you go easy as that you're already set and uh, let's remove that again close this baby up and then the next part is the other side here now for the other side it's actually another feature as well now I really don't know about this lot here might be a special feature I don't know but I think that's the time that I will have to check the manual but other than that um, you have the slot here and uh, let's bring some more light there you go there's the USB uh, slot and the USB type B cable so you will need this type of cable here um, to be able to use this and sadly the Canon selfie doesn't come with the <laughs> cable itself so it's sold separately as well which kind of sucks okay the next piece that I want to show you guys is um, well okay before going there um, you get the screen here this is not a touch screen you get the buttons here both sides looks like a button but not really but you get the on the home menu the Wi-Fi setting you get your touchpad here directional buttons zoom and zoom out back and the print features and then it even shows here some of uh, the kind of selfie as you guys have seen on the white version doesn't have a sticker but some will even show the Canon mobile app print here okay the next part that I will show you guys is uh, the slot for ouch long sorry never mind. is uh, for the printer itself uh, for the paper this is uh, for the SD slot so you have a couple of uh, feature um, ways to actually print this out which I will explain in a bit here so this is the slot here it's actually quite nice so it's apparently really easy installation and uh, this is the piece that you will need so as you guys can see there's actually the instruction there on how to do it so it's actually very simple all you have to do is flip this load your paper underneath here and you can actually put in about 18 prints and uh, more than that you might damage it so don't overload it then you just close it there and then Once you hear that click, you're good to go. And you can actually just plug this baby in and uh, start printing. And let's go to the next step, shall we? Okay, so when you're buying the ink and the paper, this is the type of um, product that you need to get. Make sure it's the proper paper. Now, it, this one here comes in uh, 108 sheets and uh, two cartridges just to let you guys know okay so this is the this is the type of paper that you will get and you will notice at the side there is a uh, cutoff there that you can actually rip out and then it's actually a glossy material as you guys can see now don't freak out when you uh, see the cartridge that is a different version than the one that comes with the Canon this is the one here it's actually a really easy installation. Now I will show you guys how to install um, the paper and the ink here. It's actually very simple. Now once you run out all you have to do is just pull this here. Uh, the What do you call this now? The paper thing. <laughs> we'll go with that. Oops. And then you open up this panel here and uh, make sure that it's in the right direction here the, um, there's actually an arrow sign that's how you place this so there you go so to remove that just one click and this one here yeah just push it out there you go remember the arrow button and 
then the next step is loading the paper. For the paper, you can put in somewhere around 18 sheets. Okay. Always place it face up like this. Fits perfectly. If you ended up getting a similar paper, when I actually got the black version here, the previous owner actually purchased this version here. It's a 4x6, but for some reason, it did not fit well. And, um... Okay, I'll just show you guys now. This is the paper. It's glossy as well, but it's too small. Okay. So, there's a reason why you need the postcard version, okay? Just making sure that you guys don't, uh screw up okay now all you have to do is just close this just slide it in and you're all set now let's plug this baby in and uh, the first thing we're gonna try out is the SD card okay let's go ahead and turn this baby on Okay, there you have it. This is the features that the, the Canon Selfie have. So you will have to use the directional button here. Sadly, it's not the touch screen. Okay. So you get multiple features here. But uh, right now, there's actually just so much to cover. But we'll check out here. Uh, check each one, one at a time before ending this video here. Okay, it says here, disconnect all device before inserting memory card. Okay. Looks like there's more to it. You get the more print options here. You actually get the two by six, two up fix, index print, DPOF print, reprint. Okay, I have no idea what DPOF print means. <laughs> okay, press back button. Then you go to the shuffle print there. Print images, a memory card, smartphone, SD. So you, this is the multiple feature there that uh, we have. And then you press the back button and then let's check the ID photo. Okay, that says, uh, shows it again. Then you go to the Wi-Fi settings here. You get connection settings. Let's press that, okay. Press okay. Get the Wi-Fi. Okay, actually, let's backtrack there. Okay, well, it looks like it actually uh, fast track there. So you get multiple settings here, and then press back. You get the direct connection. Then back again. You get the connection method here via Wi-Fi network. Same settings as well. And then last but not the least is the setup itself. You get the multiple options here. You can reset to all uh, default. You can do the print setting. You get the print finish glossy. You get the borderless. You get the page layout. Okay, let's go. Let's see the eight up here. I actually don't know what this means. So there's actually some uh, learning that needs to be done here. So I will definitely check out the manual. Let's press back again, back. Okay, you get the Wi-Fi setting over there. So um, there's just so many, so many to cover right now for the Canon Cell PCP 1300 that uh, we will be doing a separate video on how to print. So you guys can check out the link in the description below or right over there somewhere. So you guys can uh, check out if this unit is actually worth getting. Okay, thank you guys for watching. This unboxing um, took a lot longer than I expected. Don't forget to. Give this video a thumbs up and uh, maybe subscribe to my channel. Much appreciated. Okay, this is uh, Traveling Pinoy. Thank you guys for watching and also have fun, relax, and enjoy. That's how life should be. And the reason, also the reason why I actually got this uh, baby here. Um, I'm not going to be bringing this well, for my travel, but I do have a special project that I've been doing. The photo booth project. If this is actually worth using on that. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Traveling Pinoy, signing out.